So I realised that the main reason that some people on the forum might be watching my gay little computer review videos because they want to see what the bedroom is like, so I thought I'd give you a quick tour, going clockwise. Clockwise, more like. I use a Ghost in the Shell poster of my infamous anime posters. I got that free with the DVD because I'm a cheap bastard. Uh, that's something that any nerd should have, a Ghost in the Shell poster. Uh, here's a page from a GameCube magazine that I tore out because I thought it looked cool. It's Dan from Killer7. Who's reminding me that if I ever had a problem, just threaten to kill yourself and not work out alright. Call it the Lisa Gambit. Here's two pages from the Matrix comic that fell out when I was scanning it. It's uh, Technomat's favourite page. Another page from that. Some postcards my mum put up when this was her office like six years ago. A Snakes in a Plane poster that everyone remembers that movie as being very cool and funny. Uh, a Jesus stick, a replica Jesus stick that I made because I found a stick in the woods. I thought oh, I would make a good Jesus stick like Mr. Eco's from Lost. And I was going to carve in all the same like Bible references that he did. And I got Revelation, it's 1911, next number there, before I realised that that's stupid and gay and gave up, like I do with most things I start with in my life. Uh, here are all the DVDs that I own. Um, here's a bin bag that I duct taped over uh, a real fireplace that really does have a chimney because uh, a wasp nest is on the top of it and wasps would come down and attack me and you can uh, read Trollinator's tweets about killing them from about two years ago uh, here's like a pile of like dead computer parts on my dead printers that have died uh, let's see. here's a fucking hat that I got with my alienware uh, here's my... here's a fucking Ghost Recon SOCOM 2 US Navy SEAL poster that I got for you with the PlayStation magazine. Here's my shelf full of alcohol that uh, was here when this was my mum's office and I've never drunk any of it because I'm happy all the time. I don't need to poison myself to be happy like every other pathetic fucking loser on earth. Uh, here's a bunch of... Oh, here's some my dad's guitars that he has in here for some reason. Uh, here's a bunch of bullshit I don't know. Here's some comic books. Some Walking Dead. Some death notes, Naruto, you got a problem with that? Fuck off, I liked it when I was 13. Some uh, Ultimate Marvel stuff, some Sin the City. Uh, all the books that I will never read. Uh, here's my green checkered chair, here's something really artistic. Here's like my year plan, I write out the fucking days of the year and then I fucking, I mark in like when I'm gonna post mega threads and I keep track of my progress to them and I write down like what TV shows I'm watching and I draw wee circles when it's like days to do something and it's like a wee counter that comes and I, I rub out like the time I have left so I can keep track of you know all the bullshit that I'm doing, all the threads that I have to post which is uh, about the most artistic thing I've ever heard. Here's uh, a massive stack of bullshit that's usually over there, all the PlayStation comics and random garbage. Uh, here are all my fucking PS2 games, your demos in the back, it's two layered demos in the back that I've been collecting for years and years. Uh, my old computer, pile of clothes, a uh, sheepskin rug that's real, it's real nigga shit, you're cheating that Americans won't know what this is, Americans won't know what a radiator is, because they have fucking pounds of blubber on them to keep them hot anyway. Here's a painting that would that it looks like fucking heaven to Americans, but that's I just open my curtains and that's what's outside. Uh, so yeah, fuck you, Americans live in cities. And here's all my dad's music. Here's a printer that I haven't installed. Here's a dead plant that I didn't water. Here's a comic book, uh, Last Man Standing, Kill Book of a Bounty Hunter that cost me three hundred pounds on Amazon that I just keep on the floor and it's getting all dusty and I don't give a fuck because I'm a big baller. I get mad about it. Here's my notepad that I write my dreams down on uh, to practice lucid dreaming. Please note that I fuck all your waifus in my dreams. And here's some books that I am actually reading. I've uh, got some Mark Kermode in there. Three books about female psychopaths, the only literary genre that I will read. Uh, here's all my fucking PS2 games that I've yet to finish. Uh, let me show you my PS3 games. Here's uh, completed games, here's half completed games, and here's games that I haven't even opened the box of yet. Let's see your fucking gaming collection, you fucking noob gay boy. Here's a traffic sign that I stole, because that's how I roll. I'm a, I live thug life nigga. And here's my Grand Theft Auto 5 poster that I just stuck up to date. I was thinking about taking it down since like every time I turn to look at it, I'm like, why is there a fucking window? in my wall and why is Anna Lucia from Lost and Resting My Sister? Uh, and like I'm sure I'm sure none of these neither of these characters will be in the game since they always have like the sexy girl who's in all the marketing 
and she's never in actually the game. She's not a character, she's like a scrapped character or something that happens every fucking game. And I'm pretty sure there's not going to be female cops in the games. Can't see them in any screens. And like that's not politically correct to shoot a female cop, even though you could do it in Saints Row 2, one of the best games ever made. Uh, but I, I think I like it now since I can just lie here and look up and jerk off while thinking about fucking my sister or Anna Lucia is fucking her up the arse with a strap on or fucking me up the arse with a strap on. So uh, e either way works. So if you're a straight guy, I uh, get this because it's good to wink to. If you're a gay guy, I uh, get this poster and <laughs> you can wink to that. So uh, yeah, there you go. That's a tour of my room. Let me sh let me give you like an epic Lost style reveal ending when I show my face. Dun 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 dun. Oh, it's a cliffhanger! I was just trolling you.